So I woke up this morning to a text message and at first I was like, ooh, a friend. Turned out to be Capital One Bank and they were like, hey Max, do you approve this $1,400 charge to Corsair International? And I was like, what is that? What is that? And I looked it up and Corsair International is a French airline company and then I had to think, hey Max, did you order you know, a $1,400 flight with Corsair International? No, I didn't. Fraud, fraud, fraudulent charge. Now it's annoying because now they have to cut off my card. Obviously I'm gonna get that money back, but it's just like annoying. I have to wait like five days for a new card. I gotta pay with, you know, for everything in cash or whatever. I'm gonna miss out on one and a half percent cash back, which is probably what I'm most upset about. Stupid thieves. I don't understand it. We live in a digital age. Like obviously I'm gonna get contacted for a weird charge. You're not gonna get this $1,400 thing that you use my card for. Did they think that they were like, maybe you won't notice. Ah, annoying. Ah. Friday the 13th, right? Unlucky, not today. It was super doo doo caca weather now. Sun shining, birds are chirping. Thanks, planet Earth, for making this Friday fantastical. Guys, we have exciting two weeks coming up. Well, I guess, I, don't know, I mean, I have exciting two weeks, but I'll share it. So basically, we're all gonna have exciting two weeks. Um, let's see, tomorrow, which is Saturday, I have to go to Richmond with my brother because my brother's getting married in a couple months. So we have to go get fitted for tuxes. So I'm gonna take you guys there. It's gonna be very exciting with fashion and stuff. And then I move in two weeks from this Friday. I move on the 27th. Isn't that exciting? I am so stoked to move into this new apartment. I don't know, like usually I'm like, you know, every year I move and I'm like, okay, we're in a new spot. It's like whatever. But this one, this time, I'm just super excited because it's got like a balcony and then hopefully this gym thing is, this is, is working out. It is gonna work out. It's just a great day. Happy Friday. Also, if you're wondering when I'm gonna ride my little bicicleta to the gym, soon, when it's nice weather like today, but like on the weekend, but not tomorrow because I have to go to Richmond. And I don't wanna do it in the dark for, for safety and stuff. But this, these things, these have gears? Three, three of them. I don't even know if those are gears. Oh, it's got a bell, that's good, that's good. Um, yeah, cardio, fun. So loud. You know, every time when I go in to work out, I usually have like an, a video idea in mind because, you know, I like to switch it up. So some days you get a commentary, some days you get workout tips, some days you get life advice, some days you just get stupid max, sometimes you get entertainment. You never know what you get. Life is like a box of chocolates. I'm like a box of chocolates even though I'm more of a sour candy guy, but this weather is just so weathery right now. I'm feeling today to be a, uh, you know, like a pretty cool musical edit, you know, because I'm just feeling it right now. Not, not yet, not yet. That's what we're gonna do. Sit back, relax, and enjoy. Woo! I know the way you operate. It's much easier than falling again. I know you won't cooperate. But I know far too much to buckle now. I 
showed you guys my lumbars, my spinal erectors. Some people tell me that I have I have BB Pro uh, spinal erectors. I think they developed so large because I used to have such terrible form and I did conventional way back in the day that they just overdeveloped. But if you're ever wondering, Max, how come like someone the same weight, weight as you looks bigger? It's probably because all my weight is in my lower back. Let me try to show you. Do you see, do you see this? I'm not sure if you can see that, but they're like, like egg sacks on my back. <laughs> Woo! By the way, I've been listening to the Views album by Drizzy Drake ever since it came out on repeat. It's fantastic. Still, get out of here, Drake haters. You're right, Tom, this is a cool shot, man. What are we doing? So what we're doing here, fine people, is a preliminary fitting to get some sizes, colors, and design ideas for myself and my boys, my best man, Mr. Max Schooning, and then all of our groomsmen. Yeah, but for what? What's the event we're doing? Uh, I'm having this party in September. It's called uh, my wedding. The old ball and chain, you're just locking yourself away forever. Hashtag game over. Yeah, for real though. Alright, so the fitting was successful. It has been very long. We started here at like 11, it's like almost 2 now. My brother's wedding is in September. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Now we're gonna go get some food, and then we're heading back to DC today. Yes, we are. We're at this place called Havana 59. And if you guys know that I don't really enjoy breakfast food or brunch, uh, this place serves brunch until 5 o'clock p.m. So it's 2.30 and I have to get brunch. Over here, guys. Over here. Over here. They, all got, they all got cigars. I'm not a cigar guy. Super right with you guys. You look so cool. <laughs> Blow like a smoke ring. I don't work all the way down. I don't work all the way down. Secondhand smoke, dude. All right, Kevin, you're going to do it. That's terrible. Wait, you're blowing around me, bro. Secondhand smoke kills, bro. Alright, so we got a little afternoon cocktail. This is a pineapple mojito. And this is a hibiscus mojito. You're gonna eat that, eat that flower, dude, right on camera. And this eat, is a hibiscus no, no. mojito. Eat it. Oh, is that gross? You ever eaten a hibiscus before? Organic. Who is it? Organic. Um. Yeah, I, I don't normally like drink anything during the day, but you know what? When you're in Richmond with the with the, with the people, the sunlight sucks. Just having a good time, and then we're gonna head back. Chase, you excited to get married? Only a lot of it. It's only because his fiance might watch the video. Ropa hash, which is flank steak, potatoes, taters, 
You can boil mash these, stick them in the stew, it doesn't matter. Scrambled eggs. No, I don't want to eat that, dude. Do it. All right, I'll do it. I guess we. All right, I'm gonna eat this. Don't put. Don't. This is a hibiscus. Don't include mine. Because you did your. I got it. Did you? You didn't spit it out or anything? Dripping. Nice. It tastes good. All right. Get a biscuit. That's me. Okay. Yeah. Not on that, dude. First time in my life I might ever say that that brunch was fantastical. <laughs> Tom, what do you think? It's good. Woo! All right, Kevin's gonna try to scale this wall. Go for it, monkey man. He's got that man. He's gonna come at you like a spider monster. Terrible form. This is very, this is very unexciting. I'm gonna delete this Rocking video. Rocking the canes, Michael Jordan, you're proud. Wow, you did really well, dude. Time to head home. Hey Ollie, what's the weather like? It go rain. Back in good old Arlington, and what better thing to do than get more food? You guys love seeing food on this on this channel. Where are we going, Daryl? B dubs. BW3. What'd you get, Daryl? Uh, 10 honey barbecue wings. Daryl was contemplating between 10 and 8 and 12 wings. He went with 10. I'm dieting. I, I never get wings above wild wings. I don't even know if, is that a lot to eat in one no. sitting? so easy. All right, well, your boy Max got one, two, three, four, five, six chicken tenders, which I always get. Chicken, Buffalo Wild Wings has the best chicken tenders in the entire world with honey barbecue sauce. I got six because protein, because bulking. I'm at 3,500 calories, Daryl. Wait, that's 500 carb, 80-ish fat, 185 protein. Increase your protein. 3,500. Why don't you need to increase your protein? But it's bigger than that. Eat more protein. Let's call me fat. Oh my god, you can't see me. Um, all right, that's gonna conclude this. We're gonna conclude with food. Daryl, you have anything to say goodbye? Bye. <laughs>